السلام علیکم دس از دا فرسٹ ویڈیو آن کون ڈی سی ایس ان دس ویڈیو آئی ول بی گیونگ یو اے بریف انٹروڈکشن آف دا ایس پی کی سافٹ ویئر اینڈ ڈیٹا سروسز وچ از پروگرامنگ اینڈ مونیٹرنگ سافٹ ویئر فار سب کون ڈی سی ایس سب کون ڈی سی ایس از بیسیکلی ابریویٹیڈ ایز سب کون از اے کمپنی نیم مینوفیکچرر نیم او ایم نیم اینڈ ڈی سی ایس اسٹینڈ فار ڈسٹریبیوٹیڈ کنٹرول سسٹم Uh, it is uh, used for automation of a plant or a part of plant. Uh, we use TCS where we have large number of uh, IOS and uh, our automation is uh, relatively less complex. Uh, it is basically uh, alternate to PLCs. PLCs uh, are relatively uh, have fast response and uh, uh, costlier than DCS. Uh, these two are uh, these three are its uh, software data service and android tool or hmi software uh, used for monitoring of uh, uh, online monitoring of uh, uh, parameters and sak is a is its uh, programming software when we open the software uh, it has this pop up menu uh, this choose mode uh, in this choose mode we select the, our uh, subcon dcs Uh, version of uh, automation uh, gx 300x gcs2 gx 300x and ecs 100 are different variants of its uh, dcs we have uh, gx 300x installed here so i will select that uh, then i will i have these four options i will create a new file um user will be admin and default password is subcon dcs i don't have a stronger so it's a demo mode and after two hours the software will automatically exit and i have to reopen the software now it says i should uh, click the file for this new configuration i will go to desktop and create new folder here i will create a t1 file here create a t1 file not a folder here so this is the overall environment of this software we have a remaining time after which it will automatically turn off so i have 119 minutes right now after 119 minutes the software will automatically work because i don't have dongle this is the configuration and tree menu and this is the node information display area this is its toolbar and this is its menu bar so the first thing in should be uh, where we can get help if we stuck at any place this is the help menu and uh, we will select this help help topic now here we have its uh, complete uh, its complete help interface this uh, this gives the overview of this help this gives the system configuration and this is the interface uh, this will tell uh, this will tell us the stuff we have uh, followed right now we go to here this is the ecs 100 mode the x300 mode this is to mode interface introduction this is the configuration to where i told you earlier now if i have to <coughs> select uh, the controller i will go to control station i will add a new controller here i will tell if it's uh, 
let's say it's a modbus controller it is dealing with modbus communication i will write a modbus controller here simply it is for description for our understanding then i will go to here control session i will give it uh, ip let's say it's ip x1 so it's even so it, uh, it's ip x2 uh, this even if because we have uh, selected its redundancy so it is uh, asking for even number of ip address then i will go to this model here i can select the uh, model controller uh, xp248 is for modbus if i select it, it says the underlying type would be uh, because of different type okay network redundancy real time okay now if i want to add another controller for controlling ios i will go here add now it will add a new controller there i can call it uh, let's say c1 controller 1 i can again choose different number uh, different uh, version of controller we have already installed f w243c so i will be going with this controller again then if i come to operation operation station these are the stations which are installed in control room and uh, uh, at uh, plot manager station if i open it and add a new controller it will say description i can add uh, monitoring station 1 if i go to type we have three different uh, versions operation station data station and engineer engineer station so operation station is basically that station uh, on which we have operators for monitoring of parameters data station is where uh, where its backup files are stored uh, and we can get its backup configuration from there and uh, engineering station is that station uh, which is used by product manager or uh, uh, by managers for configuring of or updating uh, existing software so i will create this monitoring station one here I will give its IP according to what we have uh, uh, configured in which switches. Then I can add a new station. I can say it is a data station one. I will choose data station here. And then I can add another station and I can call it engineering station one. I will choose, uh, it's, uh, so, okay, it's engineering station, engineering station. So we have uh, uh, configured three stations and two controllers. Now if I go to iOS, we can uh, configure the further uh, card, iOS card and data transmission card in this controller.